Hello all, this is me Sonderia KS. So in this video, we will be talking about the ball where it will be moving and the player parallel, it, it will also be moving to the mouse. So let us start with the player parallel. Here, this is the player parallel we have. Now, as we wanted to move with the mouse, we wanted to change the Y position and the X position will be static. So, here, the, as the Y position will be changing, we need to give the Y position as mouse Y. That means Y position is equal to the same as the mouse Y, mouse y position. Here, now the ball needs to move. The ball doesn't have any static movement. It, it can move in various directions. It can move here, it can move anywhere. It has many directions for it. It can move, move many directions. So, what we will do now is, I will now create a variable on the x position, which will be the position of the ball x position the ball the ball has the x position of 195 and variable y that is equal to 195 also because that is the position it has and then so we have our variable here so here i am going to put x and y this is same so now the position are the same so now we want the ball to move. I can put x is equal to x plus 2. So can you see the ball is moving? We can reduce its speed if we go to 1. The ball speed will be reduced. And if you want it to be quick, we can increase the speed. It will be very fast. So now I want the ball to move in this direction. How it, it needs to move? I can change the x and y position. So as I want in this direction, x will be decreasing, it will be minus, and y position will be increasing so it will be plus so this is uh, this is for y and this is for x so i will write x position will be minus so x is equal to x minus 2 y is equal to y minus sorry plus 2 so this ball will be moving in this direction so that's it for this class. Try experimenting this one. And please subscribe, share and like this video. Thank you.